Miss Lasky, just came to let you know that you ain't <sighs> worth my time. That's why I'm here in Truman. person. Because correspondence is so hard. Truman. Where? I'll unlock yeah. it for you. Hello? What the fuck are you doing here? What the hell do you think I'm doing here? <laughs> I came here to tell you to respond to your telegram. <laughs> but what you guys can do is answer a couple of questions for me. What, ha what happened to my boys? What happened to your boys? What do you mean what happened to your boys? Give me, a, give me one second. Let me move out this way for the wagon. The boys who didn't come back after our breakout of Mr. Jimmy Lamar. What happened to them? They in prison, all of them? I wouldn't be able to tell you, Truman. I have no idea what happened to your boys, but I would assume so. Well, <laughs> so then go know. in there and you find did a out for me. Break. I didn't even know you did a fucking prison break. All right, listen, just put your fucking gun down. I'm going to look. Give me a second. Howdy there, man. Howdy there. How about we do it like Deputy said and we put down the rifle? I'm keeping this here just as insurance. And what would be the reason for using that? Well, if you guys try anything. What should I try? Out of curiosity. I don't know what you're going to try. Uh, it, see, there is a third one right over there. Yeah, well, you know, that's what usually happens when you show up at the office with a rifle out. You should put your rifle down, Truman. We can talk about this if you come on inside. I can tell you everything. Oh, I ain't happened. coming inside. I ain't coming inside. I'm fine right where I am sitting on this horse. <clears throat> I'm assuming you found out because you're back already. Put your rifle down, Truman. You want information? I'm willing to talk about it, but not once we have guns drawn here. Wonderful. All right. Well, now. Let's see. How many of them are you missing? Well, I am missing about a good three of them. Right, well, I can tell you two of them um, had pled guilty, so I don't know what happened to the other one. You'll need to scoot away from me, all right? What is wrong with you? So you think I won't kill you? Yeah, make sure he doesn't get so angry. This would not have ended well for you. Good thing. And you don't know what happened to the third one. No. There was Micah, Lawrence, and then there was the boy. Micah, Lawrence, and boy. Um, hold on. Let me. You have a name for the boy? You had your chance! Oh, don't. Oh. <laughs> uh, sort of. What is wrong with you? Hey, Truman, guess what? You're not the most biggest asshole here in the roads right now. <laughs> yeah, I know. Look at that. You Look at that. You're going up, going up places. Well, time to go to the naughty con. Come on. I'd say throw him in the cart for the idiot box. Yeah, that's what it's going. Do you have a name for the boy? 
Yeah, I was going to say that before that fella started shooting at you. Uh, Dante, I believe. Dante. Uh, I don't see any name with Dante in there, so. What's his name? Dante what? Don, I think it's Dante. It's, he's Jimmy Lamont's son. Dante Leon? By any chance? Yeah, him. Yeah? Well, last time I checked, he was riding wild over in Austin. No, no, no. I saw him, no, talk to him yesterday. Not... He was riding around. No, that's not, that's not him. Hold on. Jesus, what was his goddamn name? I don't interact with his son that much, so. Oh, oh. Jesus. Okay, you fucked up real quick now. Piece of fucking shit. Anna, you need anything? Um, if you have a tea, probably would be nice. Yeah. So, no, no, I remember now. Devlin. Devlin was his name. Devlin. Yeah, fine. Uh, let me see. Devlin? It should be Devlin Lamorne. Was his first name Jackin Joaquin? Yeah, hey, Joaquin. Yeah. Joaquin Devlin. Okay. Um, it looks like Mr. Devlin is deceased. Mr. Goodfoot. And how did that? Try to see if there's a medical report, more or less, because there should be a death report attached to it. That's how we always did with the FD, so there should be a death report of what happened. What's the name again? Joaquin Devlin. J O A Q U I N. Maybe somebody brought it up, but uh, I've not seen anything. Then. In the report itself, it says he died in the firefight. Yeah, but if no FT was around. Uh -huh. yeah. Well, I mean, that's, that's, that's it. What information you want? to know what happened to them but seeing as one of them died <sighs> well thank you very much Jumin, wait Jumin. yes warrants mount up Um, okay. <sighs> I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go in and I'll go to where that little blocked section is, kind of straight ahead to the left, those barrels and stuff. Um, I'm thinking, Evelyn, if you want to stay to, like, the right of me. What is he? Whoa! Zeke is right here behind the wall. Did you just shot at us? 
I think he's shooting up in the air, but let's go. Hey, I'm gonna say this right now. Off the horses. I know she's leading, but get the fuck off the horses now. I leave it. You literally are like the biggest target of an officer on a horse. Not trying to be rude, sorry. Just don't want to get someone shot right now. You're good. Um... Ready. Alright, I'm gonna advance to this broken down carriage that's in front of me here. Mm -hmm. She's shouting all the time. Truman! He went inside the last time I saw him. He's on the balcony. Be careful, because he's up there. Alright, I'm going forward to the rocks here. Mm hmm. Truman! Can you guys still hear me? Yes. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna get rid of this dynamite that's in front of the house, anyways. You might want to let him know because he's technically within the radius. I'm just telling you right now. I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna get closer to him so he can hear me. But I'm just letting you guys know if you hear it go off. Hey Truman, can you hear me? Truman. Truman, can you hear me? I'm gonna take it as a no. Truman, can you hear me? Now I can hear you. I now you can you hear me, Danny Sauce. All right, listen. I, I wanna get. I, I want for both of our safety, right? I want to get rid of this dynamite that's in the front there, okay? That, that's what I was trying to do. Okay. I just don't know where all the dynamite is. Right. Uh, if you want to just step inside to ensure yep. that you're okay, I'm going to do the one that's in the front here anyways. All right, shooting the dynamite. All right. All right, that's that one anyways. I know I got the one that's on the box right over there. You guys saw that. Mm -hmm. I don't know if there's one in the gazebo. Uh... There possibly is. Hold on. No, it's okay. It's okay? Okay. Yeah. Wouldn't want anyone to get blown up now. That's just nasty business. <laughs> Very nasty indeed. Right, I can hear, hold on, I can hear your other one, the man, but I don't know where the other lady is. I can't hear the other lady. I know she's somewhere over behind those tents. <laughs> uh, where is she? I'll leave it, uh, I'll leave it up to her if she wants to introduce herself and... As you were saying. Truman, listen, this this doesn't have to get bloody or anything. Let's just have a conversation, yeah? Now, you have warrants. Oh, this is, oh, I move. This is a horrible ass spot. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. You have warrants, right? Now we can talk about them. What is it exactly you're, you're hoping to do here? What's exactly you're hoping to accomplish by holding yourself up in the shady bell here? Well, no rifling, no. Seems I put myself into a corner. Put myself way into a corner. We, Lamorne, has pushed ourselves into a corner. Come on, way too far gone, especially after that last business. Devlin's dead, you bastards killed him. Well, not specifically you, but you know what I mean. The royal you. Look, I'm sorry. I'm sorry about your... Uh, what, family? Do you call each other family? 
More like brothers in arms. Brothers in arms. Well, I'm sorry about your brothers in arms passing. I know that hurts. But you're right, you kind of... You kind of have backed yourself into a bit of a corner here, but like I said, this doesn't this doesn't have to devolve into anything. We're more than willing to talk it out. If you would just come with us, you know, we can see what we can do. And then you don't have to worry about any more blood being spilled, you know? I don't think your brothers in arms would like to hear that anything happened to you either, and I know for a fact my family wouldn't like anything for me happened to me, so I feel like you and I we can we can have a peaceful talk here. Well we're talking. Keep on talking. <laughs> Alright, what is it that we can do to get you to come down peacefully and come back to the office with us. I could come down peacefully, but I ain't going to that goddamn office. Because I know what waits for me. I know what awaits for me. Goddamn government mandated trial. Goddamn, you know, I already know my charges. I've read the bounty board. Well, we could go over your charges, but we'd have to be at the office. How's your wound dealing you that I gave you last time? It's, uh... I'm better now. It was, uh... It's a nasty one there. Mm-hmm. It sure was, sure was. Yeah. <clears throat> Why don't you come down off the balcony at least? It's hard. It's hard to have a conversation watching someone pace back and forth up there. Well, it's good for me because I get to see where you guys are. I see the most lay of the land up here. <laughs> now, do I know if I come out there, there ain't gonna be a deputy down over at the front door just waiting to to. Put me in bind or put a gun to my head. <sighs> yes, you don't. You just have to take my word for it. If you want to come down and talk peacefully, we'll have peaceful talks. I think we're more than willing to do that, because I don't think any of us want anything to really dissolve into, well, a shit show. But think of your think of your options here, Truman, right? I mean what what are you gonna do here? You have three deputies. Sure I'm just a recruit, but you have two pretty high up deputies here with me. So sure you might you might get me, you might get one of them. You're not gonna be able to get all of us. So think of it here. Think of what's in your best interest here. What's in your best interest is to come peacefully, because we can work more with someone who is peaceful. We can work more with someone who's cooperative than we can with someone who's not cooperative. Talk to me, Truman. What are you thinking? I think that there's a pig over here. Yeah. <sighs> Truman, it is just you there, right? Yes, it is just me. Right. Well, think of it. You know, what, what do you guys say? You're, you're fighting for Lemoyne. How are you going to fight for Lemoyne if, if something happens here today? Well, the thing is, Lemoyne's too far gone. We tried fighting for Lemoyne. We tried. Look at it now. Look at this goddamn place. What do you have for it? Jack shit. Our one town all the way over yonder that's in ruins. You got a city that get all the goddamn 
funding to it, and you got the Rhodes, who doesn't even have Rhodes for its name. Yeah, don't even let me, don't even get me started on Van Horn, if you want to consider Van Horn a part of Lamorne too. It's close enough. I've fought all I can. I've fought all I've done. And I ran all I can run. The last thing I can do is fight for something I believe in a little bit. So I'm sorry, Miss Lasky. Open fire! He went inside! Throw the rest of the barrels! God damn! Gentlemen! Ah! Inside again! Zeke is down. Chill, man. <clears throat> How's Zeke looking? Honestly, don't know. I can't check on him. I cannot leave that. Hold on. Let me try. Jim is down. Okay, uh, let's go secure him first and then take care of Seek. Everyone's inside, so I'm just gonna. This is gonna hurt. I'm, I'm gonna tell you right now. Where are you going? No. Where are you going? S stay. Be a good host. Okay. Y you stay. Here real quick. <laughs> Jimmy! Jimmy, I did it! Fennin? <laughs> How does he looking? Very fucked up. Um, J listen, Truman, listen to me, okay? Don't move. I'm trying to stop some of the bleeding here so we can go and get you to a doctor. Zeke is just... Has possibly broken rib. I already loaded him up on a horse. Uh, I'm gonna get yours, yeah? Yeah. Come on, Truman, stay with me, okay? Come on. Oh, Jesus. Fuck. Okay. All right, let's get them. Let's get them to, to Rhodes. It's the closest town, right? Yeah. Okay, ready. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, West. Yes, Seek. I have you. Guess what? what? First day back, I'm gonna have to go on a medical on the way. The ribs don't possible. heal. He's... Mr. Truman is gone. <sighs> I have no pulse, no breathing, nothing. I don't think it's a broken room, I think it's back grace. 
It was a graze on the right side by the ribs. I thought it was broken, but I think I might have just gotten a bruise bad with the graze. Okay, we'll go off vest off. Let's take a look at this. Oh, yeah, give me a sec. Put my hand underneath my vest. Uh, I'll leave it in your hand. Just... Who's Arabian is that on the the office? That's my, that's, uh, that's Aries. Oh, okay. There's some weird folk looking at it out there. We're just looking at that horsey. Somebody's looking for a gray horsey. No, that's my Yelp. horse. Ah. Uh, did you run into a wall with it? Mm -hmm. Yelp. Nah, then it's not that horse. Okay. Someone well, I don't know. The yeah, someone said they're looking for a gray Arabian that looks like it ran into a wall. No, not that one anymore. Like with the schmush face. <laughs> no. It's definitely not Abby's there, but um May I, I hope you find it, I guess. Hey. Is it ain't our horse. stolen horse? I I don't know, it's not our horse. We're only worrying about chicken butt and sugar butt. Oh, oh, oh okay, sure, yeah. Chicken yep. butt sugar sugar butt. Yeah. I'm riding. I'm on the back of sugar butt because it looks like you got sugar on top. Betsy. No, that's you, Junior, on top. Yep. 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 Right. Well, hey. Well, um, enjoy sugar butt and chicken butt and, uh, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, what are your names? I'm Junior. I'm Wade. Junior. You go ahead. I didn't want to be rude. I don't want to be rude either. That's why I like Okay. It. Okay. Okay. Darlene. And I'm Ren. Yep. Yeah. Well, uh, nice to meet you. I'm uh, Deputy Recruit Fenelaski. Uh, yeah, uh, no, unfortunately that, that, that Arabian right there isn't the one you're looking for, but, uh, good luck on your travels, and, um, yeah. Alright. <laughs> Make that shitty talk to tell us to fuck off. Yeah, that's yeah. what it seems like. Yeah, I ran, I was waiting but for now you it's to just take off. Off. And I said, no, all right, just but you so didn't. Just just like, just like, okay. Just made it bye, look. lady. Bye, mister. Bye, other mister. Bye. You all stay safe now. Giddy up. <laughs>